What's up guys? It's been a while since I've done an update on my mini restoration and VTEC project. Uh, it is the middle of winter here in the Midwestern United States. Uh, back in the fall, I kind of had some back issues I was dealing with, so that kind of set me back. But uh, you know what? It's time to get this thing going. And if I don't get a ton of work in now, June 2017 me is going to be really mad at January 2017 me. So anyway, this is super exciting because I've got uh, two rusty areas that I cut out and I've got the patches made for them and right now I'm getting ready to prep the floor pan which is going to go in uh, the passenger side and these will be the first repairs that I make on the car. So I took the car off the road in 2001 and here it is, January 2017. Finally, something is going to go back on the car as a new repair that fix, you know, years of uh, sin and abuse and, and, and terribleness. this little flange and uh, punch tool from uh, Harbor Freight. Seems to work pretty well. It makes a pretty small punch, but I feel like those would be serviceable. I can spot weld through those little guys right onto the panel. I got a million freaking spot welds to do, so that's going to be fun. moment. I got my, my floor pan here. I got it notched. Use some uh, weld through primer on it and it's ready to fit directly into the little slot here. Just gonna get it in there. It's nice. I got kind of a weird cut up here. I don't know if you can see that because uh, I got a big old crack in the steel which is a bummer. But uh yeah, she's in there pretty good. Might be a little crooked. There we go. That's a little better on that side. I'll have to do some hammering once I get once I get a couple pieces welded. But uh, yeah, here it is. Been since 2001, and we're gonna go ahead and fire. I've been building up for this for so long. Oh man, it's gonna be great. Turn my helmet back up, I was cutting. Let's go on this Not the best plug weld I've ever done, but that'll... It's now held in place. Over there. I got some more cut on that. I didn't feel 
Lord. Here's the finished product. Doesn't look great. This is definitely not my best welding job. But it is in there. It's structural. And I can tell from this side that I did get good penetration. So I know she's held in there. Uh, man, I had just had a lot of rust up in here that I'll be, you know, having to kind of rebuild this. This this area here is up high as well. I'm gonna have to build this back down around the, the pan. But uh, all in all, man, that is not a terrible result. And once I get her good and covered up, it'll be ready to go. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Um, I'm not, not gonna do a ton of these videos just to be doing videos. I am gonna see what kind of trouble I can get in with this guy and What's going on over here with the moke? We got the head off. It's in the machine shop getting reground, getting new valve seals, or guides, guides and seals. And uh, I couldn't get hardened seats because the shop didn't have a small enough cutter. But uh, yeah, I'm thinking about uh, throwing that SPI unit on, replacing that SU carb. So. We'll see how that goes. I'll be doing some videos about that. And uh, yeah, again, man, thanks for watching.